Hi, welcome to Hikate's Crossing. Okay, we're going to do um, a little while. We're going to do a few videos of the um, Crystal Alley cards. Okay, so just for reflection. just want to take a moment and take a breath. This is one of the decks I love working with. I love the healing energy of the Crystal Alley cards. So let's just do another week of... Um, or a few days just to see how we feel and um, what card are we going to reflect on today oh there it is so today we're going to focus on cerocyte um, c e r r u s i t e and it talks about illumination. It's in the element spirit, okay, or the storm. So let's have a look at what this card is all about. So we're looking at the spirit, the storm, okay, which is the soul heart. I embrace change. Okay, so let's have a look at Cerocyte. And see what messages we sort of get. I'm not going to read everything to you um, with the book. Um, if you want to explore, I definitely suggest this is a deck that you um, add to your collection if you wish to explore um, this deck further. Illumination. Okay, this is all the chakras, so you're looking at right from the base chakra to the crown chakra, the earth, um, heart of the earth, right through to way up, of course, the twelfth chakra. Um, the affirmation, I open myself completely to the illuminating light and knowledge of the divine. Oh, Cerocyte. C-E-R-R-U-S-I-T-E -R -R -E is a lead carbonate mineral that embodies the energy of illumination. Lead was considered to be the densest and most base of all physical elements by ancient um, alchemists who sought a way to turn it to gold. In Cerocyte, we find this base metal transformed into beautiful clear crystals that stimulate the ability to manifest light in the densest aspects of your life. Illumination is the process of bringing light to something. It may be bringing light to space to dispel darkness or to the mind, to, to, to dispel ignorance. We know from science that light carries information. The ability of light to carry energy is why we use it as a medium to carry our cell phones, calls, television and radio broadcasts. When we think of light, we often think of the visible range of light and colour that we perceive using our visual sense. However, much of the spectrum of light energy is invisible to the human eye. So illumination is not just the process of bringing visible light to a dark place. It is also the process of bringing the invisible light of information to those places within us that are lacking enlightenment. On a spiritual level, illumination is the process of opening to the light of the divine mind so that any darkness of ignorance can be revealed and healed. Opening to divine illumination requires a willingness to be completely vulnerable and naked before the Creator. Of course, as a creation of the divine, it already knows you better than you know yourself. However, your willingness to fully disclose all aspects of yourself to the divine is necessary so that you can recognize and face your own fears, darkness, and ignorance as they are revealed by the light. The recognition of your own dark spaces and the release of resistance due to fear enables the light of the divine to illuminate you. There is more, of course. Let's just say that the light is dawning. So the light is coming, okay? Cerocyte is a herald of dawn, and you can expect the imminent appearance of a much brighter day than you may have experienced of late. Okay, so when this card appears in your spread, or when it comes as your card of the day, it is bringing you new information and insight that had not previously been available to you. This new perspective will help to clarify the situation and bring to light 
that which has been hidden. So it's asking us to really look at things that we may not acknowledge. And it does ask you to be vulnerable. Find the strength and vulnerability through this process. Lay yourself open to the light, the truth will surface, and all will be cleared and healed in the bright light of consciousness. So take a moment, close your eyes, and just say, I open myself completely to the illuminating light and knowledge of the divine. To me, it's sort of bringing you the knowledge or the wisdom that you need to be able to move forward on your journey. I love that. I love that card for today's reflection. So let's take a moment and just feel that suicide. Feel that energy. Feel that love. That illumination. That awakening. Bringing the light from the darkness. Okay, that's today's card for reflection. Don't forget to check the links below, check the links on my channel, like, subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded. Take care and blessed be.